Hello everyone, I'm Maria Downey with this fast cast on this Tuesday, January 16th. Here's a look at just some of your day's top stories. It's official. State lawmakers are back in Juneau. The new session kicking off today. And we have a crew there to cover all the action. Some of the pre-filed bills range from resource development funds to mental health issues. One bill could create a task force dedicated to mental health and the use of psychedelic medicine, in part to evaluate how it could help address the state's mental health crisis. Another bill would put part of the funds from North Slope Natural Gas into the permanent fund and also establishing a missing and murdered indigenous persons review commission, along with another bill, one that would fund construction and maintenance work at schools. We'll have details on day one tonight at six and of course throughout the day on alaskasnewsource.com. And while lawmakers have made it to Juneau, it's tough going around town. Some roads are impassable due to the heavy snow. School has been canceled and the city is asking folks to stay home if possible. And there's also issues at the docks. Boat owners are being warned to clear off snow and check to see if their boats are taking on water. So far, three boats have already sunk due to that heavy snow. And in Thompson Pass, or the point, and actually in Point Thompson, Alaska DEC is investigating an above-the-ground pipeline, pipeline leak. Discovered Sunday on the North Slope, the location is about 35 miles east of Prudhoe Bay. At this time, the amount of liquid natural gas con condensate is, na is not known, but cleanup is already underway. The DEC is trying to find out the cause of the leak and possible impact on the environment. To get more information on these stories along with the day's news, weather and sports, you can go to alaskasnewsource.com and also on these streaming platforms. From all of us here at the Alaska's News Source, have a great day.